Hi guys! Welcome, welcome back to About Craft. So guys, alam kong napapansin nyo po na iba po yung ating setup for today. Pagpasensyaan nyo na ako guys kasi wala po ako sa aking usual place kung saan ako nagpifilm. Nandito po ako ngayon sa bahay ng parents ko sa Quezon City. And alam ko rin po guys na it looks super weird at hindi bagay sa akin yung dark colors na ito kasi nagmumukha akong multo. But anyway guys, hindi naman po yung ating setup ang focus natin for this video dahil ang focus natin ay the banished derma roller. So I have here with me the Banish Derma Roller Kit and I'm pretty sure na yung iba sa inyo familiar na kung ano ito. Basically yung concept nito is using needles para maalis yung mga acne scars discolorations, and even wrinkles. So, I know, nakakapagtaka. Paano nga ba natin naalisin yung ating mga imperfections by using needles since ang obvious tendency ng mga karayom talaga is to actually create holes or add more scars. Pero guys, let me tell you na yung mga needles na included dito sa Banish Derma Roller Starter Kit are actually micro needles. So, what they will do is to create ultra tiny holes as in super duper maliliit lang talaga to provoke your body to produce produce antibodies, collagen, and elastin in order to heal those tiny holes and other skin imperfections as well. Anyway guys, medyo pinagpapawisan po ako kasi walang aircon dito. Kukunin ko lang yung electric fan doon at sana hindi niya ma-disrupt yung ating audio. Okay? Fingers crossed. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm back. Pasensya po ulit. If meron kayong naririnig na hindi ka aya-ayang tunog, yun po ay galing sa electric fan. Kasi guys, hindi ko talaga kaya yung init. <laughs> anyway, going back sa ating topic, right now na film ko itong video na to, I've been using the Banish Derma Roller Starter Kit for a total of 3 weeks already. Tapos guys, yung method ko in using this kit is once a week lang at night. And yes, I could say na sa course ng paggamit ko dito sa starter kit from Banish, meron naman akong nakikita ang mga differences. Pero before we proceed to that, papakita ko muna sa inyo guys yung mga items na included sa Banish Derma Roller Starter Kit. So meron silang isang pouch na ganito that comes with instructions. Along with that guys, nandito din yung mga products that we should use before and after each derma rolling session. So, iisa-isahin natin sila mamaya. Tapos guys, meron tayong malaking device like this. Ang tawag dito is the Banish Pore Smasher. And ang goal nito is to minimize your pores and improve your blood circulation for faster and better healing. And lastly, meron tayong two types of banishers. Ito nga si Banish Derma Roller. At ito naman si Banisher Stamp. So, yung pagkakaiba at itsura nila, i-discuss ko mamaya din. So, ang first step guys na ginagawa ko whenever nagagamitin ko itong mga to is of course, huhugasan ko yung aking mukha. That way, kapag ka in-apply mo na yung derma roller sa face mo, hindi magpapasukan yung makeup, yung gunk sa iyong pores para maiwasan yung further acne breakout and irritation sa skin mo. After ko maghilamos guys, meron akong i-apply na product sa aking face na included sa kit. This one is the Banish Vitamin C Beauty Elixir. So this one is a powerful antioxidant and what it does, nakakatulong siya in lightening the acne scars agad-agad. And aside from that guys, it also prepares your skin doon sa mga micro needles na i-roll natin mamaya sa face natin. So ayan siya, this comes with a nozzle and actually super duper ganda ng distribution ng nozzle niya. Kasi mist form talaga. Hindi siya buo-buo. And by the way guys, I store this pala in my refrigerator para manatiling active yung mga ingredients inside this concoction. After that guys, I then move on to the Banish Pore Smasher. So this one, nilalagay ko rin pala to sa ref kasama nga ni Vitamin C Beauty Elixir. At ang reason kung bakit nasa ref ito is to keep it cool para mas effective siya in keeping my pores closed. Tapos guys, I just roll it sa aking face. Usually, ang motion ko is from the inside out. Like that. At nakakatulong ito guys para mas lalo nga natin ma-absorb sa ating skin itong si Beauty Elixir. At saka para medyo mamanhead yung ating mukha to further prepare it sa ating mga derma rollers. Speaking of derma rollers, pagkatapos nito, I will then move on to the derma roller itself. So ito siya guys, nandito siya sa transparent container na ito. And ito yung pinaka itsura niya inside. Nakikita nyo ba guys yung mga maliliit na gray holes? Yun actually yung mga micro needles niya. At ayan, 
sila mismo yung gagawa ng maliliit na butas sa face mo to naturally induce collagen sa iyong body. By the way guys, hindi lang po sa mukha pwedeng gamitin itong derma roller. Pwede rin po siya in other parts of your body kung saan meron kang mga scars or darkness of the area. Even mga stretch marks daw guys, kayang-kayang i-target ni derma roller. Pero for me guys, ginamit ko siya for 3 weeks sa aking face, especially dito sa right cheek ko kasi dito ako merong mga prevalent na acne scars. Tapos guys, before nyo pala i-work this sa inyong face, be sure na ibabad nyo muna siya sa alcohol, kahit anong brand basta alcohol on this container included din to guys doon sa starter kit. So ang ginagawa ko, pinupuno ko to ng alcohol at binababad ko lang siya dyan for about 5 minutes. After that guys, pinoposition ko na dito sa right cheek ko kasi dito nga yung target area ko. Tapos I roll it vertically pataas and pababa. Up to 4 to 5 times only. And my way of counting that is just like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Pagkatapos nun, I will lift it up away from my skin, then proceed to another direction or another area. Also guys, hindi naman po required na vertically lang yung motion na pwede nyong gawin. You could also roll it horizontally or slanted. Pero ako, I find it effective especially sa aking cheeks na vertically yung aking motion. Pero aside from my cheeks guys, ginagamitan ko rin yung aking forehead nitong derma roller na ito. Kasi even though wala ako masyadong acne marks dyan, meron naman akong ano, wrinkles or worry lines. And since using derma rollers could actually improve collagen formation daw, naniniwala ako na it could help in alleviating wrinkles dito sa aking forehead nga. So dito naman sa forehead ko, yung aking direction is horizontally and I roll it 4 to 5 times nga. By the way, uulitin ko lang po na if ever mag-change kayo ng direction, kailangan nyo talagang i-lift and then reposition it doon sa desired direction mo. This way guys, hindi nyo matutwist yung derma roller sa skin ninyo at may iwasan yung mga scratches doon sa surface of your skin. Another important thing guys, wag na wag yung tong gagamitin dito sa may eye area ninyo kasi it is very very delicate. Ito yung pinakamanipis na part ng skin ninyo. At isa pang parte kung saan i-avoid nyo rin yung contact ng derma roller is doon sa mga parts kung saan meron kayong active acne breakout. Kasi guys, may may tendency na mas lalong ma-irritate or mas lalong ma-distribute or kumalat yung mga bakterya doon sa acne mo. So what you can do para hindi lumala yung iyong acne, instead of using the Banish Derma Roller, you could actually use the Banisher Stamp. So the Banisher Stamp looks like this. Mas maliit siya, especially yung kanyang tip. Tapos meron siyang cap that when you remove, ayan, meron na naman siyang micro needle sa taas. Pero yung kanyang micro needles are actually concentrated on a small circular plane. Allows you to spot puncture your scars, avoiding active pimples. So to tell you honestly guys, I find this more convenient. Kasi mas hindi to masakit para sa akin. By the way, using this derma roller, of course, meron siyang konting discomfort, especially doon sa mga areas kung saan maboto ka. Kasi dito sa lower part of my cheeks, wala talaga akong nafe-feel na pain whatsoever. Pero pag dumako na ako sa aking cheekbones na pagkalaki-laki, ayan na, medyo masakit siya dyan. And especially, especially sa aking forehead as in, may mga times na medyo naiiyak na ako. Kasi definitely masakit siya sa mga bony parts. Pero anyway guys, mas convenient nga to sa akin kasi hindi naman sobrang concentrated yung mga acne scars ko sa isang area lang. Okay? Usually, ano sila yung maliliit, tsaka kalat-kalat. At saka isa pa guys, yung paniniwala ko kasi na kapag okay naman yung ibang parts ng skin mo, I say huwag mo nang galawin or huwag ka nang mag-experimento pa. Kaya naman mas gusto kong gamitin ito kung saan small areas lang yung target kaysa dito na kahit yung mga areas na hindi ko naman kailangan ng tulong ay eh masasagasaan pa. And then guys, every time na matatapos ako in using this or both of this, binababad ko muli sila dito sa container na pinupuno ko ng alcohol for another 5 minutes before ko sila patuyuin at store sa kanilang respective the cases. So very very important talaga guys na hindi nyo itapon or hindi nyo mawala yung case nito at saka yung takip nito kasi ibabalik nyo sila every after use. By the way guys, speaking of uses, itong Banish Derma Roller at saka si Banisher Stamp 
pwede mo lang silang gamitin up to 3 to 4 uses, okay? After nun guys, kailangan nyo na silang palitan kasi naka-accumulate na sila ng enough bacteria at saka masyado nang nagamit yung kanilang mga needles making them less effective. At ako, since nagamit ko na nga sila for 3 times for about 3 weeks, I could say na okay na ako. Contento na ako sa effects na nabigay nila sa akin. Anyway, going back after using the Banish Derma Roller at saka si Banisher Stamp, it is required for us to use this one. Si Banish Oil. So, si Banish Oil, ito yung parang serum that will help us in boosting the effect of derma rollers. And since meron ka na mga tiny holes sa iyong face, mas magiging effective yung absorption nito. What I do, guys, is I use three drops on areas where I use the derma rollers and the derma stamp. Tapos, dinadab ko lang yung oil using my fingers. Take note, dinadab at hindi po ini-swipe. This way, mape-prevent natin yung further irritation sa ating face. Kasi, of course, merong tendency si talaga na medyo mamula yung ating skin kasi nga pinapuncture natin siya with needles. Anyway guys, I also place itong si Banish Oil sa aking refrigerator along with the Vitamin C Beauty Elixir at saka si Pore Smasher. I will then sleep with the Banish Oil sa aking face kasi usually sa gabi ko naman sila ginagamit and I will see to it na hindi ako magme-makeup for at least 8 hours. Anyway guys, included in sa Banish Derma Roller Starter Kit are two more skincare products. So, meron tayo dito Banish Pumpkin Enzyme Mask at saka si Banish Activated Charcoal Clay Mask. And these guys are very, very effective in further soothing your face and removing irritation. Hindi lamang yung temporary irritation that are brought to us by the derma rollers, pero pati na rin yung old existing irritations natin sa skin. Kasi itong dalawang to talaga, they could really remove the redness on your skin and they will definitely make it supple, fresh, and very, very soft. Anyway, ginagamit ko rin sila once a week. Magkahiwalay guys ha. And preferably on the following nights after using the derma rollers. Like for example, nag derma roller ako on Friday night. On Saturday night, gagamitin ko si Pumpkin Enzyme Mask. And on Sunday night naman ay itong si Activated Charcoal Clay Mask. So paano ko sila gamitin? Itong si Banish Activated Charcoal Clay Mask. Ginagamit ko siya before ako maglagay ng toner or moisturizer sa aking skin. At minimix ko siya guys with the Banish Vitamin C BT Elixir. Basically para siyang yung Indian Aztec Healing Clay Mask. Parang ganon. Si Banish Pumpkin Enzyme Mask. Ginagamit ko naman to after kong mag toner. And by the way, this one is natural and organic. So it is very very suitable even for the most sensitive skin. Yes, napansin ko nga na organic siya kasi kahit scent or perfume, wala sila. So, ang ginagawa ko naman dito guys ay ini-spread ko all over my face. Very, very thin layer lang. Tapos, pinapatuyo ko siya and once na na-feel ko, natuyo na siya, iwa-wash off ko rin siya. So, dito, napansin ko na every time na gagamitin ko to, the following day, hindi ako ganun kabilis mag-oil up. So, ang tendency, hindi na ako nagkaroon ng further acne breakouts kasi nga, hindi na ako ganun ka-oily. Now, guys, para sa mga effects that I I experienced. Sabi ko nga kanina, every after procedure, namumula talaga yung aking skin. And kung mapulahin talaga yung skin mo, yung redness na yun could last up to 5 to 6 hours. Parang ganon. Pero like I said kanina, hindi ka na mamumula if gumamit ka nitong activated charcoal mask or the pumpkin enzyme mask. Kasi nakaka-relax talaga sila ng skin. Pero guys, when it comes to my acne marks, I could say sobrang nag-lighten up talaga sila. Kasi almost non-existent na yung nangyari sa aking acne marks over here. To the point na minsan, hindi na ako nagpa-foundation. As in, after ko maligo, magsiskincare ako, and then sunscreen, tapos I'm good to go. Another effect na super duper na gustuhan ko guys, dati kasi meron ako kung ano dito, enlarged pores dito sa may kilay ko. Pero since pinapagulong ko nga yung derma roller on my forehead, napansin ko rin na significantly nag-close up yung mga pores na iyon. However guys, dito sa problem area ko, kung saan meron akong wrinkles, wala po akong napansin. Nandyan pa rin yung aking worry lines, nandyan pa rin yung aking wrinkles. Pero despite that, masasuggest ko pa rin sila sa inyo, especially if meron nga kayong mga acne marks. Pero like I said kanina, ingat-ingat lang, especially dito sa area na to, kung saan very delicate yung skin ninyo, at saka sa mga areas kung saan meron kayong active acne. So, there you have it guys for this video. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. Sana ay nag-enjoy kayo at may natutunan kayo. Please do leave me your thumbs up. Also, subscribe to me. It's a wrap and I will see you guys again soon. Mm -hmm.
with you.